Hi, I'm Nathan K. Working as a junior data engineer in Metric Piece Private Limited. I got this opportunity through Govi. So before joining Govi, I was watching a video of Mr. Arun Prakash, the CEO of Govi. So I was fascinated by their idea of Govi, the vernacular languages, and joined them. Actually, after the um, boot camp, I uh, started with the Python programming, and uh, after two two three weeks, I felt that I was not good enough in Python. Though they gave a code cutter platform, I have not utilized that, and I requested that I have to learn back Python. So they uh, gave me an opportunity to do that. So it gave me a confidence that they are supporting me in that process and allowed me a new different batch so uh, in that time i uh, rectified a mistake that i have to work and i had worked on code cutters and got a bit confidence in python programming and started to the the next sections of the data science process actually on uh, the next process of uh, learning the databases like an osql database mr netaji nirmal came and he was a different person and he had uh, different stuffs with him so rather than the old pedagogy styles where the people will be teaching the codes and everything or syntax directly to you he'll be saying that uh, even i don't know syntax as like that and he'll be give us the courage to see where to find that those things and how to apply them like the we have to see the official documentation also apart from that uh, curriculum he will be teaching additional steps how to do that so then i met uh, mr santosh he was the guiding force in the uh, in throughout the process of my data science so he will be teach uh, he will be saying uh, to solve um, code cutter cut problems when i approach him he'll uh, he'll when i feel sad or bad he will be there and he will be guide us what to do and what not to do then after that i had, um, went to the data science part where mr kaushik krishnan came and he he has a different style of teaching and he'll be teaching like to a kid even he had a trained uh, ninth standard kid so i came to learn that after the boot camp so during that boot camp we had a, a different experiments and challenges like a, they had a conducted a data thon uh, one day data hackathon even where i haven't heard uh, that of before so uh, like you will be attending in uh, uh, attended in um, i had attended in a metaverse platform we had met uh, people from different backgrounds so so um so and we have worked as a team and this was a challenge for me who haven't met them before and we have to find the solution within a day and i have to give solutions to that problem business problem so then another thing is that they had a uh, internal webinars like that so one such thing which was, i was interested at that a uh, uh, street scientist program where usually we will be uh, thinking uh, as a data scientist will be thinking of a big data as like that i will be thinking of uh, analyzing the e-commerce platforms data like that so here they have thought that why can why we want to use all those data as in a big platform why not to the street vendors like um, a vegetable vendor a uh, shopkeeper how we have to collect their data how the how the um, how their market operates how their shop operates how we can make them efficient and how we can help our ideas to um, grow them like that these were the things and the other things are the coding challenges we will be having a monthly coding challenges with our internal guvi geeks so these kind of ideas are different and unique and we are be having uh, uh, different different challenges um, continuously after that i will be uh, um, during the placement process mr uh, ms sudha and ms rajeshwari had helped me a lot to uh, do that so after that um, uh, during the project sessions uh, we have to take uh, they will be giving a projects or we have to uh, find the best from that and after that if you want to based on the specific criteria if you want to work in a, a specific industry you have to take other some projects and you have to work along with that the um, capstone project if you are want to work in a fintech industry or a healthcare industry or a investment or a banking or a education industry you have to take pick a data sets according to that and you, they will be help you to find the data sets and you can analyze that and uh, we can make predictions out of that also based on the different business needs like a, for a business analyst or a data scientist you have to um hone your skills according to the role that is what i'll say um thanks for listening this is what i've learned from gubi so one thing is i hope that uh, you find this well and you to go ahead in life thank you